Ankoto. Le président, veuillez vous asseoir. Le président, please be seated. The court is now back in session. Reprise de l'audience. Without further ado, we would like to continue hearing the testimony of Mr. Cham Sai, and the floor is now over to the council. La parole est à présent donnée à la partie civile qui disposera de 20 minutes pour interroger le témoin Cham Sai. So, Council did wonderfully. Thank you, Mr. President. Merci, Monsieur le Président. I may now continue putting a few more questions for Mr. Chamsai. Due to time limit, uh, I would like uh, to put a few questions Faute and temps, then hand je over poserai to que my colleague to finish Après quoi, je part of her uh, questions à mon confrère, for Mr. Chamsai. I would like uh, Mr. Witness to tell the chamber Monsieur regarding Okanseng Security Center. Le you de testified that uh, Okanseng was a re-education center for the division, but according to your de la division. Testimony question number 12, document E3, stroke 405, you say you received 12 civilians as prisoners at Okensang as well. Can you describe to the chamber, please, who were or uh, who these uh, Civilians Il s'agissait donc de prisonniers civils, new people, workers, étaient-ce des membres others? du peuple nouveau, étaient-ce des ouvriers, étaient-ce d'autres gens Le président, uh, Mr. Witness, uh, please hold attendre. on counsel for Mr. La parole Mouchier. est à la défense de Mouchier. Merci, Mr. Président. Je ne suis pas sûr. Sure. How this question relates to Je me demande en quoi cette question porte sur les communications um, so that, ou les structures, d'où mon objection. Council, please allow me to respond to this. Maître Chet Van Lee. The question was put for him because we noted that the si re-education center was pour les raisons suivantes. Nous the savons Center for the Division que ce centre and de rééducation était rattaché à la division. Mr. Chamsai said that uh, civilians were also received at the center. I would just like to ask uh, for some centre. clarification whether uh, new people pour si also detained uh, at the center, and I believe it falls within the scope of this uh, trial proceeding. Ma question s'inscrit dans le cadre fixé pour the ce president, uh, the objection is not uh, sustained. L'objection est rejetée. Le témoin doit répondre à la question posée. Réponse. Le témoin. Vers la fin de l'année, des gens ont été envoyés en provenance this center. Du secteur no 101. other people were sent Vers from centre. other sectors. Personne d'autre n'est arrivé en provenance d'autres secteurs. By late 1977, as I remember, these people were sent to the center. C'est à ce moment-là que ces gens ont été envoyés center. au centre de rééducation. Council, thank you. Question. Can you also tell the chamber, please, uh, were these people among the evacuees? Ces gens étaient-ils des évacués? Response. These people Réponse. were the base. People. Ces gens étaient des membres du peuple de base. Question. Question. Please clarify 
on one more point. Why des précisions uh, sur un point supplémentaire. Base people were Pourquoi sent ces membres du peuple de base ont-ils été envoyés dans ce centre de rééducation Response. Réponse. According to the reports we obtained, d'après uh, les rapports que nous avions obtenus, ces gens in the avaient union. été des ouvriers. And They membres du syndicat something that were implicated uh, and some people Ces didn't gens like uh, the way they ate the en way cause. they talked that's why they were sent for re-education on n'avait pas apprécié that's la all. façon dont ces gens parlaient ou mangeaient et c'est pour cela qu'ils avaient été envoyés se faire rééduquer thank you for those who were Question. sent and detained at Okansang Security Center. Were they also offered some les education session so that they could be corrected? And suivi were des they done de under the supervision? Visant à les amener à s'amender. Response. Et le cas échéant, est-ce que cela s'est fait I sous votre supervision? Some Réponse. Lessons. Je on leur how they can refashion certaines leçons de And manière à les amener à se reforger. Je leur ai aussi donné des conseils pour qu'ils puissent modifier leur comportement, leurs opinions, leur point de vue. Their fears and worries Je me suis and after aussi being re-educated employé à les calmer à les tranquilliser were returned après rééducation to their places. ces gens retournaient là d'où ils venaient question according to question document e2 rather e3 stroke 407 bar 407 in my 0040 à la page 0040 1315 en Khmer uh, friend, uh, English 0040 6222 et en français 0040 2279 vous évoquez the des purges situation which vous was évoquez very chaotic. une situation qui était très chaotique pourriez-vous revenir là-dessus. Response. After the country was liberated, Après it was la libération time du pays, that the line of the party was being implemented. La ligne du parti a été and mise en œuvre. In two stages, that such policy Cela was s'est fait implemented. en deux étapes. And I could see that in the military, the situation was rather chaotic dans l'armée, and disorganized. La était because la désorganisation régnait. people could accuse others for committing some wrongdoing. Les gens s'accusaient mutuellement and, uh, d'avoir commis des fautes. it was really disorganized. And I could also C'était know that it was a transitional period. Uh, the period uh, to une phase uh, de transition. The society into a social La société devait se transformer. Les gens and devaient remodeler social stands, leur for example, position sociale and et leur opinion. Apply to military. Cela valait aussi and pour l'armée. Soldiers who were free, who talked freely, Il y avait who des soldats qui parlaient accused, à leur guise uh, or criticized uh, one another, et qui s'accusaient ou se uh, critiquaient mutuellement. Very common. And Ce genre de situation that, était uh, très we could see that fréquent. The the situation was rather disorganized and it Was difficult to control C'était une véritable pagaille et il était and difficile de contrôler ces gens. Enemies, uh, increased. Et il y avait and de plus en plus d'ennemis. 
I can see that uh, I was not holding a senior position, je so I couldn't grasp poste élevé. very well what happened Et donc, je at the cooperative. But what I remember is that uh, we Par collected contre, the information and through education sessions we would impart des de réeducation indoctrinate uh, uh, educate uh, people to et make sure les gens. they could be um, corrected uh, should be étant que ces gens puissent the social line et se conformer policy à la ligne et à la politique Question. qui avait été fixée apart from this policy Question. did you also carry out uh, measures to purge Avez-vous pris des mesures visant policy. à mener des purges en application Response. de la politique du parti First and Réponse. Foremost, we were obliged En tout premier to lieu, implement nous étions obligés d'appliquer la politique. In Implementing such policy, Toutefois, it was not our first uh, resort uh, to kill pour ce people, faire, nous because pas recours en it was part of our first uh, plan uh, to educate people, selon to plan, rebuild uh, oneself, and les à these se were part of our measures uh, being carried out. Nous appliquions donc ce type de mesure. Thank you, says counsel, Mr. Witness. As the head of Organizing Security Question. Center. Vous étiez chef du centre de sécurité d'Okanseng. Were other cadres from the upper echelon sent to assist you or to work cadres de at the center? Supérieur étaient envoyés dans ce centre pour vous seconder dans vos Response. fonctions. There were some of them Réponse. being sent. Certains to ont été envoyés dans le centre. However, they were not of senior Mais rank. ils uh, n'occupaient pas they were de rang sent élevé. A unit, uh, a person by the name of no, Il y a eu un certain was no assigned to qui a ainsi été envoyé d'une unité pour travailler au centre de rééducation de Kansing. Like, uh, to understand Parce the que enemy communication voulait comprendre line. de he quelle manière les ennemis communiquaient. About the Elle voulait en savoir davantage sur and la situation des ennemis de l'intérieur et de l'extérieur. Et c'est pour cela que cette personne a été envoyée to au centre follow, uh, this information. en vue de recueillir de telles informations. Counsel, thank you. Question. How did you know Mr. No was sent from the general staff? Did he present uh, to you any que no letter certifying that he was major? actually sent from the general vous a présenté une lettre précisant qu'il émanait Response. Yes, justement he, de uh, major did give uh, Réponse. me the letter. Oui, il m'a présenté une telle lettre. I also called uh, to the chief of the division to uh, see whether he was uh, le chef de division actually sent uh, from the division pour voir so si cette personne venait bien du niveau de la division et so Sarun a confirmé qu'une telle tâche avait été confiée à cette personne question when he returned question did he bring Quand cette along with him the documents he acquired during the course of his work at the center? Emporté les documents qu'elle avait recueillis durant son travail Response. au centre. Yes, he did. Réponse. Oui. He collected the documents Il a recueilli he des documents obtained during the work at Ogun Alors qu'il travaillait au centre center. de sécurité d'Ogun Thank you, Mr. Witness. Question. Question. You said uh, no came from Vous the general staff to grasp no the internal and external enemy situation. Can you tell the chamber a little bit more on 
how will you characterize the internal and external Quand on enemies? How are they different? Par les ennemis de l'intérieur et de l'extérieur. En quoi ces deux catégories Response. se distinguent-elles My Réponse. unit uh, was located Mon in the northeast uh, se trouvait area, which dans la zone was nord rather remote uh, from the central part of the country. And people du pays. really wanted to know the situation there. And first Les and foremost, uh, they would like to establish, uh, to have the knowledge of surtout how the enemies operated and communicated. Uh, Les That's, that's why they would like to know about this communication system because every now and then confessions or words in de the report temps temps, could tell us about the enemies, il y avait about dans les rapports, the informations communication concernant and for, les for that et uh, they would like to know more et donc, euh, on voulait it. en savoir davantage à ce sujet. Thank you. Question. Question. As the head of uh, the re-education center, en tant que chef were you familiar with the disappearance of some commanders or leaders of the military? Si des chefs de l'armée ou des commandants ont disparu? Response. Réponse. Yes, I was, and I oui. was familiar with this. But what I learned back then was that when people disappeared, they were believed to have been called to on study sessions, and they never returned. Mais ensuite, ils ne revenaient jamais. Question. Do you Question. still recollect uh, any of the names of the individuals who disappeared? Vous souvenez-vous du nom de certaines personnes qui ont disparu à l'époque? Response. Réponse. I can't uh, recall everyone and Je I me think uh, pas de tout my monde. recollection regarding names are too poor to Je me um, souviens mal tell des noms. you et donc je ne peux uh, about pas this, vous informer uh, à ce sujet. Question. Do you still remember question. just a name? Pourriez-vous citer ne fût-ce qu'un nom? A senior individual in the military, for example. Le nom just par exemple d'un haut cannot, commandant okay. de l'armée. Si vous ne pouvez pas le faire, ce n'est pas grave. Response. Réponse. Ha. To be sure and to be on the safe side. Uh, I may not wish to name an individual because uh, certain, if I say a person ça, was a uh, bad one because he had been sent to re-education or je to study session, then I would be uh, presuming or ou si je dis que était un élément, um, speculating, so I would not do that. Pas le faire. Thank you. According to the same document, uh, E3 toujours, uh, stroke uh, 405, uh, and the question number 8. Question number 8. ERN number in Khmer 004T, 13 English 00306013 and French 00422251. You say that uh, at the beginning there were roughly 50 prisoners, but this number increased to about 100. How can you describe or why these uh, prisoners uh, increased? Response. Réponse. I said uh, at the beginning there were about five to sixty prisoners, dit and later on the number increased. It is not difficult to tell you about this because the situation developed from 
bad to worse. La situation s'est aggravée. The, the purchase um, operation was intensified. Les purges se sont intensifiées. For that, uh, more and more people were et donc, sent hein, to de plus en plus re-education centers. Re and this also coincides uh, with the intensifying situation at the Et border area. Et cela correspond areas. aussi à une intensification de la situation uh, the frontière. The council, uh, the 20 minutes uh, we allocated uh, to councils for the civil uh, parties have now uh, been used. Les 20 minutes qui avaient été accordées aux parties civiles se sont écoulées. Some are going to look. Thank you, Mr. Witness, uh, for beaucoup, enlightening the court on uh, uh, the various issues. I, I don't know whether or not the President would grant us uh, some more time uh, so that my colleagues can proceed with further questions. The President, uh, unfortunately, your time is up now. Next. I hand over the floor to the defense team for Mr. Nguyen to put the question uh, to the witness. You may proceed. Thank you, Mr. President. Good morning, Good morning Mr. Witness. Bonjour, um, I don't have many questions for you, just um, some follow-up questions in, res in respect of answers that you have been giving this morning and, and earlier in uh, January. Um, my first question uh, would be, uh, you were asked earlier in January on vous a demandé, uh, by the prosecution, why you joined the, the revolution in 1970. And you have replied that it was a call from uh, Prince Norodom Sihanouk that convinced you to join the revolution. Now, do you remember whether there were any other reasons for you in 1970 to join the revolution? The first reason, as I mentioned earlier, it was due to the appeal by the then Prince uh, Sihanouk. And there was another personal reason of mine, because at that time my home village, my hometown was along the uh, Cambodian-Vietnamese border. At the time, the Vietnamese uh, forces the from time, South Vietnam, uh, Sud Vietnamian, encroached on our uh, territory, and then they attacked terre. our village. And Et there were also air raids uh, as well in our hometown back then. Mr. Witness, the way that um, the Lon Nol regime uh, acted after the coup d'état in 1970, these acts or that behavior of Lon Nol officials or soldiers also contributed to you joining the revolution? Has eu an influence on your decision to join the revolution? No, at that time it did not have any influence on my decision yet. And as I uh, told you earlier, 
the first reason was the appeal by the then uh, Prince uh, Nurudam Sihanouk, and then later it was my uh, personal uh, reason uh, because of my uh, hometown was being attacked at that time, and then the war broke out uh, in my village. Uh, so I felt compelled uh, to join the revolution, and there was no choice for me at that time but to uh, took refuge uh, in the forest, and I had to join the resistance forces then. Thank you, Mr. Witness. Question. In an answer to a question about your military activities in the period 1970-1975, you have answered in January, and I quote from the transcript, page 37, that I was still the military chairperson leading the soldiers to engage in the fighting in the battlefield. Could you expand, Mr. Witness, what you meant with leading the soldiers to engage in the fighting in the battlefield? What, what did you do exactly for the military I'm afraid I do not quite understand your question. Could you please uh, elaborate your question further? Of course, Mr. Witness, you, you have said earlier in January on a question from the prosecution that you were a military chairperson and that you were leading the soldiers to engage in the fighting in the battlefield. Pour mener des combats sur les champs de bataille. Could you expand today what you what you meant with that answer? What did you do que -vous dire when you were leading the soldiers que -vous que to engage in the fight in the battlefield? I led the soldier to engage in the battlefields. At that time, it was against uh, the Lonol uh, administration in order to liberate the nation. W were you actively engaged in combat in the period between 70 si and 75? Were you engaged in combat between 70 and 75? Yes, I was. Oui. We were engaged in constant combat until Et the war was over in Phnom Penh. The combat did not cease before Phnom Penh fell. And in, in those engagements, in, those, in that donc, combat, did your unit suffer uh, casualties? Votre unité a-t-elle connu des pertes? Réponse. Yes, uh, there were oui. many casualties. Uh, gradually in all uh, battlefields, and I myself was also injured and Le wounded several times as well in uh, many battles combat, all the way to Phnom Penh. Uh, long de ces sur le de Phnom Penh. Were at any point in time ever soldiers of your Question. unit uh, captured by que des uh, the long long military? military? Ont été fait prisonniers par les forces militaire de l'Ondol. Réponse. Soldiers uh, subordinated to my unit uh, were never uh, captured by Aucun the soldiers de mon unité of l'Ondol. Aucun soldat de mon unité n'a été fait prisonnier par Do you know of capture of soldiers of, the liber of other Question. units of the Liberation Army by the Long Nol military? Si d'autres soldats de l'Armée de Libération ont été faits prisonniers par l'Armée de Long Nol? Question. 
It's a bit difficult to answer this question whether or not there were any captures of soldiers from other units because I did not witness by uh, myself. I only heard uh, rumors uh, from others, and uh, our units were stationed uh, quite far away from each other, and we uh, did not uh, know uh, forces uh, of other units. At that time, uh, there were no um, uh, proper communication functions, and we had to we had to mobile uh, or move from one position to another position uh, separately and in small units. Mr. Witness, in, an, in one of your answers in January on the question of the prosecution, in response to a question of accusation, you have dit uh, testified, that is on page 49 of the transcript, that the, and I quote, liberated army, I presume that means the liberation army, was of a high morale. They did not bon conduct any vicious acts toward the people. Plutôt that was the discipline of the army. Et pas commis uh, could you elaborate la on what you meant with saying that the Liberation Army was of a high morale and that there was discipline within the army. The President, que de witness, très uh, please hold on, because uh, there is Le objection Monsieur from the prosecution. Mr. Mr. Prosecutor, you may proceed. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Il ne s'agit pas d'une objection, mais plutôt d'une question de méthodologie. C'est mon question avec respect à la méthodologie. Si mon passage de la transcription de janvier donnait un numéro de page dans les trois langues, ou alors, peut-être que c'est plus facile de donner l'heure à laquelle la réponse est donnée, ou à ce que chacun puisse retrouver le passage dans la transcription, afin que tous ceux qui ont suivi puissent en fait uh, verify where he is in his document. Thank you. The President. Council, uh, you may uh, provide uh, information, necessary information, as suggested by uh, the co prosecutor, uh, either the uh, ERN uh, numbers or the uh, times when the question was uh, answered by this particular witness. Mr. Uh, Coupe, could you? Uh, uh, entertain the uh, prosecutor with this. Uh, yes, of course, Mr. President. I, I did say, I think, that I was on page 49 of the transcript. Um, and it is on, on, on top of that page, the, the first five sentences. At this point, I don't have the exact ERN numbers in Khmer or in French. As an alternative, I could mais, formulate more loosely about what mais the je peux aussi witness poser des has testified earlier. I will rephrase. Mr. Mr. Witness, you testified earlier dit. that the, last, the liberation le army was of a high morale and that there was a level of uh, discipline within the army. Could you please expand on what you meant when you said that earlier? <coughs> Concerning the morality of the Liberation Army, during the Liberation Era, at that time we had to abide by the 12 uh, Code of Morality. We do not steal uh, the properties of the people. We have to cling to the good life morality. And I uh, myself uh, also uh, adhered uh, to this uh, code of morality. I never abused um, my role, and I never committed any vicious act against the people. And I had to uh, comply with the uh, rules of uh, soldiers. At that time, we had to resist against the uh, government forces. Aux 
I, I presume when you were giving this answer that you were talking about yourself and about your unit, uh, are you in a position also to speak about other units of other zones uh, in respect to discipline and morale? Uh, I don't I cannot, I cannot comment uh, on the uh, conduct of other units. Of course, we cling to only one uh, line, uh, but as for the actual practice uh, on the ground, I, I cannot uh, comment on uh, the conduct of other units. Have you ever seen Question. reports or have you ever heard reports about jamais other parts of the Liberation Army lu des uh, who were not so disciplinary and of a high morale and of a high morale during the evacuation of the population in 1975 in April in Phnom Penh? But to my knowledge, there was no information concerning any immoral conduct or corruption or so. Uh, there was no uh, torture or uh, any other barbaric act or so. Uh, by the, on the part of the soldier against the, the civilian people uh, when they uh, came to Phnom Penh at the time. Have you ever seen or heard Question. reports indicating there was a difference in discipline and morale between the forces entering Phnom Penh from the south uh, in April 75, as opposed to forces entering Phnom Penh from the north and the northwest. Au sein des unités qui venaient par le sud, plutôt que celles qui venaient du nord ou euh, de l'ouest. As for this uh, particular question, I, I do not have any answer to it because I did not have a whole picture of the situation at that time because I was a low-ranking official. Uh, I did not have uh, a full grasp of the uh, overall situation like people in the higher command. Thank you, Mr. Bittes. I would like to move on to another subject. In January, you have given testimony um, about en janvier, uh, a conference which took place at the Olympic Stadium in 1975. One of the things that you have testified to is that, according to you, uh, that uh, there were 21 senior leaders que, à votre avis, il y avait 21 uh, present during the conference. Qui avait à cette now my question conference to you is, présent, et savoir, the number 21 seems to be very specific. Enfin, 21, how how do you know there were 21 senior leaders? Y avait Enough, 21 for instance, 20 or 22 or 19. Ou what is the basis of your knowledge in respect of that particular number. Yes, I can respond to this question. At the time, I was invited to attend the meeting, the conference as well, uh, from the uh, regiment. Uh, we were the representative from regiment. And I was also in uh, uh, 
command post uh, as well. So uh, I was uh, invited to attend this uh, conference to oversee what uh, was going on and what uh, were the matters or issues to be discussed at that time. Thank you, thank you for that answer, Mr. Witness. But my question was, you have been speaking earlier in January, <laughs> testifying about 21 vous avez, senior leaders present. Vous avez dit en janvier y avait 21 and my question was whether you could présent. explain to the trial chamber how you Je arrived at that number of 21 seniors. Vous nous expliquer comment vous en êtes arrivé à ce chiffre, 21. In the programs, they established the organizing committee, and these organizing committee members uh, were uh, named. And then, uh, normally, those uh, uh, organizing committee members were, were named, and uh, members who participate in the conference would know uh, those who were in the organizing committees of the conference. So did you, you, you base your conclusion Question. Donc, that there were 21 senior soldiers present on this program, or were there other reasons for you? You founded on this program of the conference to say that there were 21 hauts dirigeants, or are there other information that you want to draw this conclusion? But, uh, There were uh, documentation as well. Uh, there were mention of names uh, of uh, senior uh, leaders at that time. And inside the party itself, it also announced uh, the uh, presiding members uh, of the conference. But if you ask me as to who was in what uh, position at that time, I, 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 I could not recall, uh, but there was a, a mention of uh, the 21 leaders. Are you saying that you actually saw the number of 21 Question. in the documentation that you had at that time? Êtes-vous en train de dire que vous avez vu ce chiffre 21 dans les documents que vous avez lus à l'époque Yes, I did. Réponse. C'est exact. Thank you. I move on to another subject. Mr. Witness, je vous remercie. You were asked in January. En janvier about the contents of one of the revolutionary flags. And you answered in response that you were not in the capacity to be offered a revolutionary red flag to read. You have been saying that you were a member of the Youth League and that you were not privy to the content of the Revolutionary League. Now, would you be able to tell us what the procedure was, what the standards were for who at that time were receiving issues of the Revolutionary flag and who were? At that time, the period lasted for three years, eight months, and 20 days. And during this period, the individual members uh, have to mind uh, their own business. But in terms of the training based on the uh, revolutionary flag, uh, there were ongoing uh, training. 
and circulation of um, the issue of this uh, revolutionary flag. So this uh, revolutionary flag were uh, material used uh, for training as well in order to um, redirect the direction of leadership of the party. De diffuser les instructions provenant des échelons supérieurs du parti. I understand your answer, Mr. Witness, but my question was whether you know who were in a position to receive issues of the revolutionary flag and who were who within the CPK who were authorized to receive and read issues of the revolutionary flag. Do you know? Thank you very much. Thank you. 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 So your question is, uh, who uh, gave the revolutionary flag? In the party rank, the youth league was the um, organization to implement uh, the uh, internal matters of the party, and party members, the full-fledged member of the party, can also uh, implement uh, the party line as well. And as for the documentation and the study material, uh, normally it was uh, circulated to party members. Normally at each uh, section or each uh, uh, unit uh, there was a secretary and it was the secretary who uh, disseminate uh, information received from the upper authority. Mr. Witters, maybe it's a, it's a translation issue, maybe I just don't understand correctly what you've been saying, but you have said earlier, you testified earlier in January, that you were not in the capacity to be offered uh, the revolutionary red flag. But do you know whether there was a division, for instance, in rank within the CPK, as to who were then receiving these issues and who were not? Qui au sein du Parti communiste du Cambodge pouvait recevoir étendard révolutionnaire? Réponse. As I said, uh, only the party Comme members, dis, the full-fledged party members, parti received the issue of a revolutionary flag. Those uh, who are only candidate members, uh, they do not uh, receive uh, the uh, revolutionary flag, but uh, they receive the uh, revolutionary youth magazine. Do you know how the full members who did receive issues of the revolutionary uh, flag Comment ces membres de plein droit qui recevaient étant la révolutionnaire communicate the contents of a particular issue diffusé to the le contenu non dans full members of the CPK or the lower de, ranking à des members of, of the CPK aux autres membres du PCK ou ou ceux qui n'étaient pas membres Response. I cannot describe in detail the inside of the party's affairs. So I am afraid I cannot do this, and I'm sorry. Je ne peux donc pas répondre à la question. Désolé. The President, Council, thank you. And thank you, Mr. Witness. It is now Merci, appropriate Merci, moment Monsieur le témoin. for lunch adjournment to the chamber will adjourn. Pour le now, a next session will be resumed at 1.30. 1.30. Court officer is now instructed to Monsieur assist uh, the witness Veuillez and his jury counsel during the adjournment and have them return to the courtroom by 1.30 p.m. Veuillez les ramener dans le prétoire pour 13h30. 
Security personnel are now instructed to bring Mr. de sécurité to his veuillez cell. conduire M. Kiosampan à sa cellule temporaire And bring him back to the et by le ramener dans le prétoire pour 13h30. Suspension de l'audience.